Well, my new book is going to be very similar to my memoir, The Thrill of the Chase. I'm going to publish some of my blogs, some stories that I've written that are not blogs, and I've gone through my scrapbooks and pulled out my life with Peggy through the years, Germany, uh, when we were kids, and I'm writing lengthy captions to some of them. Uh, some captions are going to be a page and a half long, so they're just they're just many stories illustrated by, by vintage photographs and by Danny Bortleson, who's making the wonderful drawings for me. And uh, Lou Bruno is going to be the producer of the book to work, work with the printer and the binders and and. Uh, Lovely Susan Caldwell is my designer, the same designer that made my Thrill of the Chase book is designing this. And this morning I looked at, at three different proposals that she's made, and I told her I wanted all three of them. The folio for each one, and it, it'll say the name of the title with the name of the story. Uh -huh. First of all, the, the book has to feel warm. You have to want to pick it up and hold it. And it has to be personal. It ha It has to be... It has to have my signature, personal signature on every page. And the thing is, I can take that one out if you want and put the house in there again, too. You know, like I can repeat the house and ghost this back a little bit more. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that house behind the writing, I don't think. Well, see, the reason why I liked it is because that whole photograph is there, and that I love seeing this. Mm -hmm. But I can ghost it back more or even just soften the windows behind there a little bit more. I'm not sure about this um, drop initial cap, but... Yeah, I mean, we know. can play with... I still like the idea of what you were suggesting. Um, it's like you I did like that red one we did well, here. Lou, no, I like what Lou was talking about. He goes, maybe we do a uh, wax stamp, you know, that it, it could be just your lowercase ff. And you know how a wax stamp, like they used to seal mm -hmm. envelopes? Mm -hmm. We could just create that, and that's a nice little three-dimensional pop of red or a color or something like Yellow, that. Yellow, green, yeah. whatever. Yeah. She um, introduced this key line around, yeah. and we could do that with every blog, uh, because I like this. I, I think that looks... I, I like that. Like with the thrill of the chase, uh, Susan put the little postmarks in there and the little corners on the photograph. I mean, it's a, it, it's a kind of a homegrown scrapbook. And this new book of mine, is, is it's going to be that way. And uh, uh, there's going to be funny things. You know, I, we tell a story about in my motel in West Yellowstone, Ronald Reagan checked into room four and he lost his key at midnight and couldn't get in. So he went around back and he, he climbed through the bathroom window to get in and there's a big item in New York, I mean, in the Los Angeles Times, that said our governor climbed in through the bathroom window. I mean, that made us famous. You got you to gotta draw a picture of him on the outside with nothing but his, his rear end showing and two legs staying on a box. So we'll have, on, on the left-hand side of the page, we'll have, have him looking at his rear end and his legs, and on the right-hand side of the page, we'll have him coming in the window. How does that sound? I'm going to let you read my book. I'm not going to charge you to read my book. Yeah. Come sit down right <laughs> she, she, here. Yeah, come on. Here we go. Show her. He wants to show her Mexico Beach. I've been there. I know. <laughs> You're gorgeous. Every picture I see of you, I'm like, whoa. I'm going to make it larger here. Oh, the phone call. See here? here? There's your head. <laughs> That's right. That's I sat on the floor. Uh, I think it's going to be good. I'm, I'm, I'm very proud of this book. It's kind of a sequel to my memoir, The Thrill of the Chase. And I've gone back and forth with titles. I was going to call this book Chasing a Vagabond. Can you read? Here, let me put it Here, in put 100%. Here, put it in 100%. That's way too and much And it says block. first home. <laughs> yeah, no, you that's, look that's so life cute. size, Peggy. Okay, so here it says she didn't bait her hook or remove it from the fish and I go dot 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 there was always a bunch of retired guys sitting and fishing who would um who would do those things for her <laughs> they did I mean I never touched the fish I bet be me <laughs> and then here it's like then he filleted and you cooked and you caught <laughs> that was a that was a hammerhead shark and he made me hold it oh, it was a hammerhead shark 
A little one. A little one. And you made me hold it. Well, yeah. you're, you're an adventurer. I'm not. <laughs> this will probably be my last book. I've got three more books in my computer, but I doubt that I'll, I'll finish those. I, I've quit giving myself suspenses. I don't have any deadlines anymore. And I'm, I'm just gonna take things as they come. I'm having fun.